The only major update I would like to do is turn France and Germany red. But we haven't got approval. Egypt, we're going to turn yellow. Egypt is yellow. It's going into civil war hardcore. Okay. It's going to civil war hardcore. It's not going to be uh, pretty. I say Egypt, civil war. Do we have a second? I'm putting it on anyway. <laughs> do we have a second? If people disagree, I'll take it off. But I think Egypt is a civil war. Remember, we're doing this proactively, right? Like a lot of these, a lot of the stuff we put on here, it was weeks, months uh, later that, oh yeah, it's civil war or war. Eldegas sec uh, seconded. Okay, cool. I don't think Joe Biden even understands what he, <laughs> he had for breakfast. No. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. Um, Gozi Moka says, Egypt civil war how? Egypt civil war because Egypt is not preventing Israel from committing genocide. Egypt has closed the border to Gaza. Egypt is not really allowing aid to go into Gaza, not really. Israel is controlling the aid going into Gaza. Egypt could easily turn to Israel and say, fuck you, we control the aid going into Gaza. Kick the Israelis out of there at the border, open up the doors and send in a shit ton of aid, right? They're not doing that. They're cutting a deal with Israel, the United States and the IMF to take billions of dollars to create a camp in the Sinai to bring all the Palestinians in there, right? Once they do that, man, this shit's going to blow sky high. Blow sky high. Jordan, another place, Jordan is going to be in civil war too. That's my guess. Okay. Jordan is another military base for the United States. Very tightly controlled. Very tightly controlled. Right. Very tightly controlled. I know the kings come out and said, oh, yes, Israel must stop the genocide. But remember, that king was educated in the UK. His wife is British. He speaks with a British accent. He is part of the oligarchy, right? Gozimoka. I do not think the Egyptian people will fight uh, Sisi. He runs the army as a former general. Sure, but you don't need to directly confront the military to have a civil war. You could have serious unrest, terrorist activities, things blowing up, people being assassinated, people disappearing. Uh, and I think uh, you're underestimating Arab Revolution Part 2. I think Arab Revolution Part 1, because if there's a civil war in Egypt, it's not a color revolution. It's not a Soros color revolution anymore. It's a real revolution. And once this goes, once this goes, you won't be able to turn it back it will go the way of iran okay it will take decades but it will be just like iran we'll see if it happens or not we'll see if it happens or not i i'm hoping it calms down but i don't think it's going to calm down 